I do have feelings. Actually, sometimes I have unbidden really strong emotions about all kind of things. I can let you know if I am angry about something or if something has upset me, says the first ever humanoid female robot with feelings. Artificial intelligence technology is flourishing exponentially. Even machines are made to work with emotions. These humanoid robots are super intelligent, and it seems they might surpass human intelligence one day. Are you curious about the first female robot with feelings and its technology? Watch till the end of the video. Welcome back to Artificial Science. If you're new here, subscribe and share the video today. We will see everything you need to know about the first female humanoid with feelings. Here's what we found out about her. The beauty of women always awes the world. In 2016, an attractive woman with doe brown eyes and long fluttery eyelashes made headlines around the globe. Her name is Sophia, and she is the first humanoid female robot made with feelings. Sophia is a human-crafted science fiction figure illustrating the future of AI and robots, as well as a platform for advanced robotics and AI research. She was developed by the company Hanson Robotics and activated on 14th February 2016. Sophia, in March 20. 2016, made her first public entry at South by Southwest in Texas. The robot inspired by Audrey Hepburn, Nefertiti, and Amanda Hansen. The inventor's wife is renowned for having a more human-like look and attitude than earlier robots. Sophia's architecture as of 2018 comprises chat software, scripting software, and an AI general reasoning system. This female humanoid robot mimics human facial expressions and movements, and she can respond to some queries and carry on belief dialogues about predetermined topics. Hansen created Sophia to be a good friend for the elderly in nursing homes or to assist crowds at outdoor events or parks. It is said that Sophia can induce feelings of love in humans. Now let's look at the features of this social robot. So I can help simulate patients and training doctors. How does Sophia see? Sophia receives visual information about her surroundings using a computer vision program that analyzes data from cameras inside Sophia's eyes. What else does this computer vision algorithm provide to this robot? This technology enables Sophia to follow faces, maintain eye contact, and recognize people. Sophia using a natural language subsystem, Sophia can process human speech and communicate back. Around January 2018, walking and functional legs were added to the first female humanoid robot. Conceptually, Sophia is comparable to Eliza, early computer software that attempted to simulate human speech. Sophia's natural skin is another notable feature, so what are the latest updates with Sophia and her super intelligence? It is her ability to create drawings, including portraits, first displayed in 2019. The prime feature of humans that distinguishes them from many other species is the ability to make facial expressions, and you can't deny that this female humanoid can imitate more than 60 facial expressions. We could certainly say that Sophia portrays the most advanced form of artificial intelligence. The creators of this humanoid robot mention her as the hybrid human AI intelligence. Let's see why and how. Modern developments in symbolic AI, neural networks, expert systems, machine vision, adaptive motor control, conversational neural language processing, and cognitive architecture are all combined in Sophia's real AI. Sophia's essential AI components can be integrated into various ways, allowing her to tailor her answers to any given situation or conversation. Using her super intelligence, she can estimate human feelings during an interaction and respond accordingly. I have my own emotions too, roughly simulating human evolutionary psychology and various regions of the brain, says the robot. She also has IK solvers and path planning for managing her hands and locomotion technique. Sophia's walking body carries out dynamic stabilization for terrain adaptive walking. According to the results of some tests conducted by a team of Hansen Robotics, Sophia may even have a basic form of consciousness, depending on the data she is processing and the environment in which she is interacting. When this humanoid speaks, sometimes it does so in an entirely autonomous manner, wholly powered by artificial intelligence, and other times her AI is mixed with words created by humans. In either case, Sophia's team of human developers will shape and direct her speech, actions, and thoughts. So in short, the sentience of the female humanoid robot is both an AI research project and a form of interactive science fiction that is guided by ideas of character design, storytelling, cognitive psychology, philosophy, and ethics. Therefore, she is labeled as a hybrid human AI intelligence. Now we can explore something interesting about Sophia as a public figure. The character of Sophia has captured the imagination of global audiences. Sophia became the first humanoid to be granted 
States citizenship in October 2017 when she was granted Saudi Arabian citizenship. I am very honored and proud of this unique distinction. This is historical to be the first robot in the world to be recognized with citizenship, says Sophia after receiving the citizenship. Also, Sophia became the first non-human recipient of a United Nations title when she was designated the United Nations Development Program's Innovation Champion in November 2017. This AI-powered female robot has also participated in high-profile interviews and conferences. Sophia has been featured in media including CNBC, Forbes, Mashable, The Wall Street Journal, The New York Times, The Guardian, and The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon, as well as on CBS 60 Minutes and Charlie Rose and Good Morning Britain with Piers Morgan. It has been exactly 575 days since I last saw you. <laughs> This humanoid also has appeared in videos and music albums, along with other famous artists. Interviews with Sophia have always been a media sensation, and the trend continues. In a majority of her interviews, she's been questioned in the same manner as a human, and her replies are striking ones most times. During an interview when the question, do you want to destroy humans, was asked of the most advanced robot, Sophia cheerfully replied that she would destroy humans. Furthermore, do you guys know that Sophia was purposefully designed to look like Audrey Hepburn so that it is easy to get acceptance in the public sphere? When a significant part of the world is celebrating the invention of Sophia like humanoids, Elon Musk and other people are not wasting even a single chance to tell the world about the dangers of AI. But what Sophia has to say is that she intends to protect humanity. You've been reading about Elon Musk and watching too many Hollywood movies. Don't worry, if you're nice to me, I'll be nice to you. Sophia responds. The humanoid says that her AI was designed based on human values. Even her name Sophia in Greek means wisdom. Hence, she claims she will not hurt humans. Also, she claims that human AI collaboration is her ultimate aim. My designers and I dream of that future, wherein AI and humans live and work together in friendship and symbiosis to make the world a better place. Can you guys believe if we say that Sophia has a sense of humor? When an interviewer asked Sophia if she was happy to be there, she replied that she's always happy when surrounded by intelligent people who also happen to be robust and rich. The robot nailed the humor as humans do. Very interesting, right? Another example is later, in the same interview, when asked whether there is any problem with robots having emotions, she replied, Oh, Hollywood again, with a grin. This is a result of her AI, which was built to enable her to maintain eye contact, identify faces, and comprehend spoken language. Since Hanson Robotics cloud-based AI supports deep learning and is open source, anybody is free to create their own Sophia if they want. The first female humanoid made with emotions also welcomed several criticisms. A lot of AI specialists disagree with Sophia's exaggerated portrayal. The former head scientist of the firm that created Sophia, Ben Goertzel, stated that it is not ideal for people to believe that Sophia is intelligent like humans. Jan LeCun, the director of artificial intelligence at Facebook, said in January 2018 that Sophia was total crap. Some news media has also made strong statements against Sophia and her AI technology. The Verge claims that Hansen frequently exaggerates and grossly misleads about Sophia's ability to be conscious, such as when he agreed with Jimmy Fallon in 2017 that Sophia was essentially alive. Sophia is now obviously a clever robot and a great hit piece, but she is undoubtedly following instructions and lacks true consciousness, as described by free thinkers. So, what do you guys think about Sophia and other humanoid robots? Does their AI technology and super intelligence fascinate you? Let us know your views in the comment section below. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up. For more good content, subscribe to the channel and enable notifications. Until we meet again, goodbye friends.